Hello everyone, Bingo Bang Bang here, and today I am really, really excited. I've got a booster box of the English release of the first set for the Digimon card game. Now you might be able to tell from the playmat that I am a massive Digimon fan, but this is also the first booster box for any TCG that I have ever had. So as I say, I'm really, really excited about this. So the booster box itself comes with 24 packs. Each pack has 12 cards. There's also a box topper and a promo pack inside. And I also got a couple of dash packs, which are single card promo packs. So let's take a look at them first. There's a single card in here. I want to be really, really careful with the packaging. Man, these are some thin packets. Um, so in these dash packs, there are, as I say, five different cards that you could get. Four of them are rare. That's Agumon, Gabumon, Metal Seedramon, and Puppetmon. And there is also a chance of a super rare, which is Machine Dramon. Oof. So there is the Puppetmon with a beautiful foil design on that. I'm a big fan of the Dark Masters, so that's a cool card to have. And then pack number two. Hoping that the regular packs are a bit easier to open. And Gabumon. The whole Gabumon line is my favourite line in all of Digimon. So again, really, really happy with this as a promo. You might be able to tell that I'm a fan of the Gabumon line from my playmat, which I designed myself specifically for this card game. Now it's time to get into this box. So in the set there are 187 different cards. But there are also 17 alternate art cards as well as those cards. 69 commons, 50 uncommons, 45 rares, 20 super rares and 3 secret rares. So here's our box topper promo, which is an alt art of Izzy. And two cards in this promo pack. The rarity on these is all P or promo. So there's a chance of a Garurumon, a Were Garurumon. Agumon, Greymon, Vidramon Zero, and Tai Kamiya V Tamer. Let's see what we get. Looks like Agumon to me. Okay, first thing that I am noticing is that the packaging on these is not great. Yeah. Agumon. Let's 
and Greymon. So it looks like those two card packs that you get in there are set. So you would get Agumon and Greymon, Garurumon and Weregarurumon, and then Vidramon Zero and Tai V Tamer. So there are four different artwork types on these booster packs. All of which are really cool. But let's get to it. So we have got Frigimon, Golden Ripper. So you have Digimon, you have option cards, and you have Tamers. Option cards are normally things like the attacks, and they give you different options as you play the game. Gomamon. Gorillamon, Gravity Crush, Sukemon, Pumpkinmon, Loader Leomon, Boltmon, Beomon. Cerberus Mon for a rare. So the last two cards in each pack are your rare slots. So you could have two rares, a rare and a secret rare maybe if you're lucky, or a rare and a super rare. I can definitely see a shiny edge underneath this card, so we'll get to that in a minute. But the rares have a foil edge border. You can see that there just on the border of the artwork and on the text of the level of the Digimon down here and on the option cards um, they might sometimes have the security symbol as foil as well. I'm just gonna shimmy the regular cards over here. rare down here and rust tyrannomon for my first super rare that's really cool recently i've been reusing my 20th anniversary v pet and i managed to jogress or dna digivolve to rust tyrannomon he stayed alive for about three weeks which is pretty pretty good going for a v pet And then the final slot in the pack, you get a index card for all of the cards that are in the set. But it's also a memory gauge, which is quite helpful. Um, so that means that if you don't buy the starter decks and all you're doing is planning on buying boosters, you've got the memory gauge to be able to play and keep a track of your memory through the game. Pack number two. So at this point, obviously, these boosters have only just come out. Um, the starter decks themselves still haven't actually released over in the UK as of the time of recording this. Um, I did have the Japanese starter decks during their initial release. Still got them boxed. So for now, it looks like I'm going to be trying to make decks out of this booster box. Anyway, we have got Dark Tyrannomon, Munchomon, Rapamon, 
Boring Storm. Leolmon. Piximon. Gyomon. It's cool to see things from Tamers in this set. Bebedemon. Saber Leomon, who's only an uncommon. Growlmon, nice. Metal Tyrannomon for a rare. I'll go quite nicely with my Rust Tyrannomon. And Izzy for another rare, as you can see, yeah. The outline of Izzy himself is there in foil. And the security effect logo is also in foil. That's cool. And then on this one, a player one memory gauge. Could just be me. I could just be bad at opening boosters. I do it a lot, but every single company has different packaging. So, Atomic Ray, Metal Greymon, Numamon, Volcanic Drumon, Smashed Potatoes. Monzemon, Goblimon, Jagamon, another Metal Greymon, this time in red, the other one was black, Greymon, I'm getting some decent red cards, Togemon, for our first rare I have a friend who is probably going to be wanting to build a Togemon deck, and that's cool. And Ikakumon for our second rare. Nice. Honestly, I don't think that I'm going to be disappointed with any of the cards that I'm getting in these packs. Obviously, everyone always wants the secret rares and the old dark cards, but I just like them all. Night Raid. Toy Agumon. Pagumon, Sea Sermon, Cockatorimon, Ogremon, Vegemon, Back for Revenge. Magnadramon, Sirenmon, we've got TK for our first rare of this pack, oh, and Omnimon as a super rare, wow, okay, uh, cool. Oh, I'm, I'm very happy with that. And there I was saying, oh yeah, I'm not really that fussed about what cards that I get in, in these packs. But I'm like four boosters in and I've got Omnimon. Whew. Okay. Gonna carefully put you on the playmat. Let's, let's give you a little bit of room. 
over there. Okay. Well, I mean, that's, that's good going. I'm kind of intrigued because he is a super rare. Um, I didn't actually really look to see what the secret rare cards are. I wanted to actually have some surprises, so. Uh, nuclear Laser, Hagurimon, Kapurimon, Vilemon, V Nova Blast, Piximon, Hearts Attack, Spider Shooter. I love that the option cards have the attack names. I think that's great. Kurisarimon. Altmon. Kari for our first rare. And Yokomon for a rare. Now that's really interesting that the in-training Digimon are classified as rares in these. Obviously you only have a smaller deck of those on the side. But that's, that's an interesting way of doing it. I quite like that, rather than having them as commons. Obviously you don't really want to be having too many of the baby Digimon or in training Digimon. And then you're unable to actually play a deck. So Gardramon, Dolphmon, Smashed Potatoes, Metal Tyranomon, Armadillomon, Gabumon, this time it's the purple Gabumon. Hornbuster, Davidramon, Garuramon, and he's got a bone in his mouth. Very happy with that. Radiation Blade, Cupimon. I see something interestingly shiny behind this card. So let's just take a second to appreciate Cupimon. And that there is a secret rare Vidramon. Look how shiny that is. Oh, that's cool. We're gonna put you in the middle. Right, so I'm not even halfway through the box and I've already had a secret rare and two super rares. This is the thing is, I really don't know what to expect from a booster box. Especially when it is a new set like this. Let me know in the comments below what kind of pulls you've had, if you've had any of these packs so far. Wizardman. The Olmon. Blastfire. Greymon. Kudamon, Dark Tyranimon, Heat Viper, Weregarurumon, nice, Petermon, Devimon, Flower Cannon for a rare, Oh, Tiger as another rare. So they're bringing in characters from elsewhere then. I just assumed that they would only have the original, like Digidestined as the Tamers. That's cool.
seriously, this packaging. Okay. Andromon. Used to be one of my favourites. Sukaimon. Kabu Terramon. Ogremon. Atomic Ray. Kokotorimon. Impmon. Kiyaramon. Demidevimon. Myotismon. That's got all the makings for a deck just out of that one booster. I saw some shiny again. So we've got Ty as a rare. And Wargreymon, super rare. That's some really cool artwork. Oh man, I'm, I'm so happy with this right now. Oh, okay. I think the only thing that's slightly upsetting is obviously it's going to be a while before my friends and I can actually play this game. Gramon Purple. Monodramon. Forbidden Temptation. Liamon. Volcanic Dramon. Golden Ripper. Tyrannomon. Chirinmon. Darkness Claw. Cherrymon. Inframon for a first rare. And Puppetmon for a second rare. That's cool, so I just look up the promo Puppetmon and now the regular Puppetmon. Pugumon, Chumon, Numamon, Gorillamon, Muchomon, Metal Greymon, Blade of the True, Darsmon, Tentamon, Tapermon, Skull Greymon for a rare, and Joe for our second rare. Good old Joe. Okay, we are nearly halfway through the pack. So, Kokuomon, Pumpkinmon, Gyomon, Monzemon, Digitamon, Great Tornado, Goblimon, Groundramon, Gotsumon, Woodmon, another Puppetmon rare. And a Piedmon Super Rare. Well, now I want to complete the Dark Masters. Dimension Scissor, Pogamon Expert, Florizamon, Caesarmon, 
Night Raid, Gomamon, Frigimon, Freemon, Metal Etamon, Lodo Leomon, Mimi for a rare, and Infinity Cannon for a rare option card. So halfway through the booster box and we have got four super rares and one secret rare. What do you reckon? We're going to get to a second secret rare? I don't know. I, given that there are only three in the set, discounting the alternate art card versions, probably not going to get another one, but we can hope. So... Metal Greymon, Dimension Scissor, Monodramon, Digitimamon, Metal Tyranimon, Gravity Crush, Cockatorimon, Kiaramon, Metal Etamon, Ware Garurumon, Yamon for a rare. And Agumon for a rare. So I think just because of the colours of Gabumon, I'm probably going to be playing blue and purple decks mainly. Golden Ripper. Monzemon, Pokemon Expert, Numamon, Chumon, Blast Fire, Agumon, just having a great time out there, Magnadramon, Cherrymon, Spider Shooter, Cerberusmon for a rare, and Ty. For another rare. I do like the fact that the Tamers have got different types so you can play different decks with your favourite characters. I don't know, looking at this at the minute. If I want to actually be able to use any of my super rares, I might have to go green. In Magic the Gathering, I never play green. In Pokemon, I never play green. In Final Fantasy, I do play green, so maybe just for the Puppetmons and the Rust Tyranimon. So we have got Atomic Ray, Electmon, Ogremon, Toyagumon, Hearts Attack, Wagurumon, Gomamon, Sirenmon, Kuagamon, Gotsumon, Raremon for our First rare. And Shield of the Just. Nice. I'm hoping for more of the um, Tamers series of cards. Especially for Terriermon. Another one of my favourites. If that one ends up as being a green deck, then I think that's going to be the way that I'll end up playing green. So, Leomon. Great Tornado. Gorillamon. Caesarmon. Heat Viper. Pumpkinmon. Tyrannomon. Tinkermon. Darkness Claw. Raulmon, Symphony Number no. One, Polyphony, for our first rare. Kentorusmon, for a super rare there. That just looks incredibly shiny. We're still going well.
So, Gardramon, Spiral Sword, Impmon, Oblivion Bird, Greymon, Garurumon, Mushroomon, Leomon, Roundramon, Jagamon, Anjumon for a rare. That's nice. I'm so happy right now. So that there would be the alt art of Metal Gururumon as a super rare. I don't care if the card's not good. I, I mean, I hope that it is, but I, I'm happy. I'm very happy. It's just so pretty. I really like this artwork style on here. Bring that up, get a better look. Don't worry, I will sleeve them later. I could stop there. I don't, don't, I don't see. I got Metal Gururumon. I don't think there's really gonna be anything that's gonna top that, so. We'll carry on though, because, you know, we've got something like six or seven packs left. Forbidden Temptation. Liamon. Gabumon. Smash Potatoes. Gilmon. Florizimon. Kabuterimon. Wanyamon. Woodmon. Garurumon. That's a very shiny card underneath there. Um, so we got Matt. And Rosemon Super Rare. I gotta say I am impressed about the rate of the rares, or the super rares in here, and the fact that I got a secret rare as well. I'm happy with that. As I say, I don't really know what the actual rates are of them. If anyone knows, please feel free to let me know. Is this like on par for what you would expect? So, Vegemon. Nuclear Laser, Hagurumon, Kapurimon, Vilemon, Venova Blast, Gabumon, Saberleomon, River of Power, Tapirmon, Sumimon for a rare. And Trump Sword for a rare option. Interesting as well that they're not sort of overdoing it with the options. They are trying to get you to just pull the Digimon that you want. Whether that will be good in competitive play, I have no idea. But we will find out later when we actually play the game. So, Metal Tyranimon, Digitimamon, Hornbuster, Dolphmon, Andromon, Monodromon, Agamon Expert. You can tell he's an expert because he has got a lab coat and a mortarboard. Devimon. Chirinmon, Freemon, Metal Seedramon for a rare. That means I am only missing Machine Dramon now, and then I have all of the Dark Masters. Here 
He's only a rare, though. Um, and tie for our second rare. Feels a little bit unfair to me, but Puppetmon, Piedmon, they're both super rares. And then that Metal Seedramon is a rare, but I think, no, there was a, there was a super rare version. Is it a super rare version in the dash packs? I don't remember. Just seems like it's getting shafted. So, Great Tornado, Impmon, Leomon, Armadillomon, Mushroomon, Oblivion Bird, Okuwamon, Kurisarimon, Breakdramon, Monmon, Terror's Cluster for a rare. And that is a Lilithmon super rare. Again, really cool artwork. Ain't no Metal Gururumon, but it'll do. Getting near the end of the box now. About three packs left, I think, including this one. So, Tyrannomon. Blastfire. Kabuterimon. Agumon. Heat Viper. Elekmon. Sukaimon. Back for Revenge. Hyandramon. Megadramon. Sora for a rare, and Gabumon for a rare. Just look at him. <laughs> I don't know what it is, I just like him. It was always just, you know. It was a bit of an introvert, I think that's probably why. why he appealed to me when I was watching Digimon growing up. Anywho, Blade of the True. Garurumon. Dimension Scissor. Florizimon. Kokuamon. Wizardmon. Heart's Attack, Greymon, Tentamon, Metal Greymon, TK for a rare, and Patamon for another rare. That's cool because that is the first time that I've actually gotten that card, I think. It is. That's the first Pokemon that I've pulled. Okay, here we go then. Final booster. Can we pull another secret rail? Probably not. Can we pull another super rare? Maybe. Does it matter anyway because we pulled the Metal Gururumon? Nah. I, I peaked too soon. I mean, that and the Omnimon. Well, I forgot all about Omnimon just because of the fact that I got a Metal Gururumon. <sighs> okay, so, Kudamon. Gardramon. Spiral Sword. Greymon. Wergarurumon. Chumon. Forbidden Temptation, Radiation Blade, 
Demi Devimon. Darsmon. Cameramon for a rare. I did wonder if I would be seeing this card. It's featured on some of the option cards that I've been pulling. It's an absolutely horrifying Digimon. Well, that was a point then. And... Oopamon for a final rare. Well, there we go. That is uh, my first ever booster box and I'm very happy with how that went. You know, eight super rares, one of which is an alt art, a secret rare, yeah, I, I can't complain at all. This has been a lot of fun to do. Um, let me know in the comments below what you think. Have you had a chance to get hold of any of the Digimon boosters yet? Are there certain cards that you want to build a deck around? I'm hoping that for the second set I can get another booster box, but I don't know if anyone heard they had quite a few distribution issues with this because they did a pre-release, a special pre-order thing where they were selling out booster boxes early. Obviously it was to try and build hype and get people to get excited for the general release, but that Brexit pandemic, it's made it quite difficult to get hold of um, a booster box. But saying that, you know, I got one. Um, I'm very happy and very lucky to have done that. Am I still going to be buying regular boosters? Yeah, I will still be buying uh, some more regular boosters from my local game shops as soon as I can get back out there. Um, obviously, if you do have a local game store, please support them online during these really tough times. And then hopefully when the world is a bit more normal, we can all go back to our game shops, we can play some games, and we can just have a great time. Well, with all that being said, I've got a lot of tidying up to do. Um, so, thank you for watching. Uh, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and all of those nice things. Take care, and thanks again. Bye-bye.